And we're back. Today we're discussing politics in the Middle East. Today we're going to paint some happy little trees. Like the one over there. Oh, wait, we're surrounded by happy little trees. Hey, a campfire! Go there. You're not going there. Oh, also, I can't wait to do the island mission when we do it. Oh, that's the best. We're in like this the two man island challenge. Oh, uh, uh, one thing we we, we uh, uh oh, it's wanderer. Okay. Once we get there, I want to do the uh, two player. Yeah, that's all uh, I'm saying. Yeah. Um. Yeah, I'll, I'll tell you when we switch over. Uh, it's just wind by fire. No, um, no, no, no. You talk to him. He's gonna. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Eric. I, that is the. That worst is the way I've ever seen Eric spelled. It's, that's your... That's Eric. <laughs> Sorry, if your name is spelled Eric like that, I don't mean you, just this one guy. If you look like him, I'm sorry. He looks so weird. <laughs> like, the cell shading in this is fucking beautiful, but like... Some of the faces... Yeah. It's just rough. I'm heading for Zori's domain now, but I'm lost. I just was about to, I was just about to, whatever, fuck that. But then, like, I heard a voice come from the North Tower, and it was like a real... I see you. I don't care what he has to say, quite frankly. It sounded like... I don't give a shit. When Frodo hears Sauron's voice in Lord of the Rings, like, I see you. Can I just say, I've run across, like, like I, I've been playing this for an entire day. Um, I've run across maybe... Professional. Four or yeah, right. Four or five uh, characters. Oh, yeah, oh, right. That was just sad. Yup, that was incredibly sad. I need to fucking Bambi. Go. Part of the reason that I stopped, that we went back to the village was to cook, and I just didn't. Shit, uh, I'm such a good hunter. He what? No, oh. he was running. Ooh. Oh wait, I can't scream. Can't scream. Oh yeah. Uh, uh, sorry about that. Um. You find motion controls would be different. Bambi's mother! I don't like motion Bambi! Mama. Just kill the man. Put a gun, I put a bow against his head. There's no trigger, no. There's no trigger. Um. Good, good, good parody, Will. Good job. I did it. You did it, Reddit. Wow. It's beautiful. <laughs> well, that seems like it'll be the smallest climb over there. Jesus Christ, this game's huge. I love it so much. I said, um, I bought this game with the last of my physical money. Like, I had no money, and I, my brother, I, okay, let me explain. I think my brother lost this game for me. And arms. No, no, arms was my fault. I had arms, I loved arms, but, uh, I, uh, lost my arms in Korea. Um, but, uh, shit. No, no, oh, god damn it! Oh, I just looked up you to see you were drowning. Aren't you glad I took control? Um, <laughs> god damn it! Okay, we're going this way now. Um, but, oh, what was I in the middle saying? Oh yeah, um... You lost arms. Yeah, so... No, no, I... Now you just have legs. I don't know what happened to arms, quite frankly. Um, but... Um... What happened with... Uh, the Wii U version of Breath of the Wild I had, which I played that game, like... Religiously? Oh my god. Yeah. Just never stopping. You're not gonna make this. I'm not, but I'm gonna try and swim. Was there gonna dash in my mind? Oh, there might be, like, land over where those stick thingies are. Maybe. Okay, never mind. Um, or I won't, because I'm really bad at swimming in there. It's gonna be close. It's, or I'm just not gonna make it. But, um, so I, 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 Good luck yeah, that looks like a I played this game religiously on the Wii U, and, like, never stopped. Uh, and one day, when my, my brother is hanging out with his girlfriend, so he kicks me out of the basement, where we're recording right now. Mm -hmm. Um, and I just hang out in here all the time. This is my place. Um, even at my work, hey, even at my uh, work desk uh, over there, and um, take that grass. um, my 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 brother comes over to his girlfriend and is like, we're gonna hang out here. I'm like, fine, whatever. Um, 
and they like to play su New Super Mario Bros. Wii, which is an okay game. Um, and they're playing it, and I come back once they leave, and uh, I, I open the Wii U, and it's not Breath of the Wild, it's Super Mario Brothers. So I open up the Super Mario Brothers disc, can't can't find um, Breath of the Wild. I can't even find the fucking box. It's not like I carried it around with me. Um, and it, it pissed me off that this thing got lost, and I knew it wasn't my fault. Do you know, how, like, oh no? So I, so I didn't have the Switch when it came out. Shit, I didn't have the, I didn't have the Switch when it came out. All I had was the Wii U, so I bought that. Um, and there was, there was a time where I just wanted an excuse to. Use your bomb set. Like a little more. That's not a bomb. Uh, there, there was a time where I wanted to just have an excuse to play Breath of the Wild and do it all alone and not have anyone bother me. So I told my mom that I needed to stay s uh, s after school. And so I brought my entire Wii U and the console l l and like the game, the gamepad, and just hunkered a myself in the... Uh, what killed what? me? I think one of the... The, the goat box, no, the box blend, like, phew, like oh, up over like, the hill and hit you. Maybe, but um, I brought my Wii U with me and played it with the office right behind me. And I'll never forget. I I, I could have sworn that I saw someone looking at me. I was just playing it on the Wii U gamepad, mm -hmm. and I brought an entire fucking console because I love that game so much. So when I just couldn't find it one day, I wanted to murder someone. Mm -hmm. And then ever since then, I just missed the game. Oh. I'm this far back. Oh. Holy shit. Wow. Okay. Um. So I feel like we've been talking about like specific stuff uh, the past couple episodes. I've been wanting to say like we really like Yu-Gi-Oh. <laughs> I don't know what I was expecting. That's true. It's a thousand percent true. Jesus Christ. Just wasn't expecting it. Like, yeah, we really <laughs> like you. You sounded... <laughs> Guys, I have a confession. I have a confession. <laughs> we <I'm>, are... We're <laughs> duelists. <laughs> there he is! It started when I was... It started, it, started. When I, it started when I was five, and it's just... <laughs> I love him. He has a little beard. It's just a leaf. I like to... See, what I like to think is that he still thinks he's like a really small guy. Oh. I'm gonna upgrade my bow. Do you think if like if you touch his belly it would be soft like really hard like a tree? I think it'd be hard. I do too, but I, I like the the uh the f just thing like you just poke him and just be like bloop. See I his uh, little satchel. <laughs> yeah, whether you know it or not. Um da -da -da -da. <laughs> he says it. Ah, da -da -da -da. Ah, he's adorable. Uh, again, like, he still has the same... Oh, wait. Oh, shit. Damn it. He's teleporting away. Oh, oh not yet. Yeah. Once you leave the area. They're poop. <laughs> yeah, did you not know that? What? The poop? Korok seeds are literally poop. I, did, I thought it was just a joke. No. Oh. I was confirmed by the director. <laughs> I, I think it was the director. Uh, he said, but like everyone thought that the whole joke that the final thing you get for collecting all like 900 of them are that uh, you get a piece of poop because you weren't supposed to do that. But no, in reality, oh, I'm gonna put on my armor. Yeah. Oh yeah. Wait, why am I using that? I don't like wearing it. It looks really ugly. Well, I put on one or one of my bosses just in case. I, don't really I do whatever I do the test of strength. Which also, I played through a good amount of this game without knowing you could upgrade armor. Oh yeah, I. Whenever I'd go fight a boss, I had my fully upgraded uh, soldier's armor. Also, I love the the uh, the different elemental rods. I love them so much. Uh, I, I sometimes like the fire one can be fun because like, it just kind of like bounce around like Mario. I I use it to um. Get a new lineup. 
That what just happened there? That one was spinning out too. Oh, 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 the magic just happened. Did you see that? Oh, yeah. I call that Breath of the Wild magic. Because when all... you kill off. Yeah, no, it's just like what. I just like randomly hit him and he goes flying. Mm -hmm. Oh, the environmental kills are the best. Oh, I love God. killing this game. The combat is like. That's why I, like, I, I know you don't. Like. Uh, we'll, we'll get back to the Yu Gi Oh thing. This is not your favorite Zelda game. But this might be mine. Oh, it's like I'm not like it's not good. I love this game. Oh, it's so good. so much. Like when when I texted you that I got this again, you were like, "I'm proud." I'm proud. Yeah. That will not break. <laughs> oh. Yeah. I stand corrected, even though I'm sitting. Fucking fake Zelda fan. <laughs> wow. <laughs> That's cocky yeah. word. That 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 is cocky where it hurts. Cocky where it hurts. <laughs> yep. Uh, that that is um an insult. You are the Zelda guy in our group of friends. I like to think I am the Zelda guy. You are the Zelda guy. Um, but this is this is my favorite. Uh, that next to Wind Waker, and some people say the original doesn't hold up, but let me tell you, I fucking love the original. I know, I know, you do love the original. Um, I'm like basically 2D Breath of the Wild. Yeah, yeah, that's a good look at. It. I'm like a lot of people. Ocarina has a really, really special place in my heart, and. I always go back and forth because I would I would die for Ocarina of Time. But then again, some I days I would not. I would. Some days I'm like Ah, oh, Minish Cap. And everyone's like what? Oh Minish Cap is so good. It's like a lot of people just never play and they're like, What's what's a what's a Minish Cap? I I, like, I think oh. I think it is the blend of Link to the Past and Ocarina. Yeah. That's what that's so good. Like Link's sound effects are that of Ocarina. Like when he's rolling he has like the kid link screen. I'm like, oh uh, uh, another unpopular opinion that I hold. Fucking love Spirit Tracks. I haven't played Spirit Tracks. Oh uh, that was that was like one of the Zelda games I had yeah, as a kid. Um I don't I don't I, I remember I had the manga for Phantom Hourglass. That was a lot of good. Um but Spirit Tracks, I loved adventuring around in the train. And it was a, it was a lot like Wind Waker where you can get upgrades for it. But um honestly the best part was that you got to hang out with Zelda the entire time. Mm -hmm. And I love Nintendo characters and like and girl Nintendo characters are always just so cute and fun. Um, and so yeah, especially Mother Brain. Yeah, the best. <laughs> She's the cutest. Don't ever talk to me. <laughs> oh gosh, we're just you disgusting brain. I don't want to get into how much we love Game Grumps. Yeah. <laughs> um, we do. And Star Bomb. Us oh, and Ninja Sex Party. Third album's coming out at some point. I know um, it's done. It just. Okay, let's, let's move on. Um, but like the the parts I remember most fondly from that are the, the fact the parts where. Zelda possesses a. I think it's a. I think it is the Dark Knight. The, yeah. Yeah, like you're, you're going up the tower, and that's something and I like. I'm still afraid of rats! Oh, she's so cute, and that. And that. And I love that they put that in Smash. Oh, yeah, Jesus. Yeah. Oh, oh, my God. Oh, again, I want to save the Smash talk for later, but. Holy shit, I love Smash. Or let's just talk about Smash right now and talk about it later. Well, um, it's. Just, yeah, I'm just going by time wise. Okay, okay, um. I love Smash Brother. <laughs> this is what I'm gonna say right now. Go! Go! <laughs> Neither of us are big sport players. What are you talking about? I'm a sport boy. I have no problem with sports. Uh, uh, some, <laughs> some sports I love Because you're play. a fucking nerd. Yeah, like me. Yeah, I'm, so I'm humbled to be in your presence. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a great boy. One of my favorite jokes is just like sport ball. <laughs> I say sport ball so much. Yeah, uh, a friend of mine works at CVS or worked at CVS, and they had oh, Jerry. Yeah, J Jerry, sport M M Mr. S uh, Sporticus, Mr. Simon Feld, Sporticus from Lazy Town. <laughs> sport what? <laughs> Didn't that was the protagonist? Well, not the protagonist, but like the <laughs> the hero guy of the town. He was. I think it was like Sporticus. There's also the lesser known DC villain, Sportsmaster. Yeah, Sportsmaster. Yeah. Injustice. Uh, I, I know him from his appearance in the, uh, the, sh the amazing Justice League show. Mm, that was a good show. Which they fucking took off of Netflix. That's because DC's making their streaming Because DC's 
fucking pissing me off. I'm a DC. I love DC. Yeah, I'm a DC fan, but like that move, I'm just like, I, I give you all my love. Whenever someone like says like why your movies aren't doing great, I'm always on defending you. But can I, I do too? Can, I do. I can I, I just I, get Batman Beyond on Netflix, please? I I am such a like uh, you know like he Andrew and I we disagree on a lot of things, uh, but we both share a love for the DC movies. And that's pure. And I think we can agree that's purely not because they're quality, but because mm. Batman, oh, the Flash, <laughs> the Flash, <laughs> the Flush. <laughs> uh, yeah, we 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 love those. And oh, I don't know. It's like that that whole service is so shitty to me. What are we talking about? We get so distracted. Um, we're talking about spirit tracks. Oh yes. Um, were we? No, we weren't. We were. Something. How did we get to DC? I know this is shrine. Thank you. Sports. Sportmaster. Oh, yeah, us. Us. Um, but, yeah, like, he was in one of my favorite episodes of the Justice League uh, animated show, where, uh, oh, it, 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 it was Hawkgirl, Green Lantern, and The Flash, I believe. They go into this alternate world uh, that is that is, like, a classic version of like all the superheroes, there's a guy that's clearly Batman, a guy that's clearly um, Superman, and a guy that's just the Green Lantern. Oh, this trial! I always hated getting into here. Just set it on fire. It's raining. You're raining. <laughs> on my parade. Um. <laughs> I did. <laughs> You're like, I'm gonna do it. <laughs> um. You did it, Reddit. What the hell? Where did that come from? It was right in front of you. Oh, it's not. It's, I, thought, I thought it wasn't raining anymore. It is spooky how fast they come at you. Super spooky. Zap, zap, zap. zap. <laughs> he dropped his. his John. J A W N. Yeah. Oh, I love this. I love that. The boomerangs? Yep. Yeah. Um, but in that, so, it's like they go back to a classic version of the Justice League, and at first you think the whole point is that they, oh, uh, they're fighting the bad guys and they'll learn some things. No, it fucking turns out that this is a post-apocalyptic nuclear wasteland and a kid that used to be the, um, that used to be part of their team was like just the kid's sidekick he gained psychic powers and was like deformed by all this and he recreated them and trapped all these people and forced them to play in this world where he got to be with his heroes and like everyone was like mentally destroyed by this i don't remember that part of the episode and, yeah and no and and the saddest part about it is these these heroes uh, were a hundred percent fake and they died, and it, if they killed, if, if they like fought the kid back and tried to uh, end him, they they would die too. And so they end up killing the kid because they don't want to put anybody through torture anymore. They fucking give up their existence. That's a great. Way